Χαίρετε κυρίες και κύριοι, είμαι ο Ρος Ραμ, ο καθηγητός του Πανεπιστήμιου Στάνφορντ και σκηνοθέτης του Στάνφορντ Σόμερ Θεήτερ. Αλλά ζέχασα περίπου όλα τα ελληνικά μου, πρέπει να μιλάω ελληνικά. Ευχαριστώ. I'm thrilled to greet you all as the artistic director of Stanford Summer Theater, and we are very proud and happy to bring to the uh, Michal Kakianis Foundation our production of The Wanderings of Odysseus. I've been the artistic director at Stanford Summer Theater for 14 years. It's a very interesting program because it uses professional actors, but they work closely with drama students here at Stanford, and we do a professional season uh, every summer. And two summers ago, we did a set of performances built around, the, uh, around Homer and Homer, Homeric epic, featuring a production of The Wanderings of Odysseus, which is a treatment of the first half of the Odyssey of Homer. This production had an old history. It was actually performed originally almost 20 years ago at the J. Paul Getty Museum at, uh, in Los Angeles. And then we remounted it a couple of years ago. And we were very happy to interest some um, representatives of the Kakianis Foundation who saw the production and were very excited about bringing it to, to Greece. Well, this is a dream of mine because I used to live in Greece many, many years ago, although as you can tell I've forgotten most of my Greek, um, but I've never actually done um, a performance of any Greek material in, uh, in Greece. In addition to being the director of Stanford Summer Theater, I'm a professor of drama and of classical literature, of classics. I work on Greek tragedy. So the opportunity to work on something like The Wanderings of Odysseus in Athens is just a dream come true for me. Let me say something about our project in Athens. Not only are we bringing the performances of Wanderings of Odysseus to the, to the city, but we're also offering some seminars and a series of workshops using our professional actors in our company to teach um, interested students uh, uh, from Greece and also um, teachers and professors of uh, drama and classical literature. So the project is not simply a set of performances, but it's also seminars and workshops. This is part of the Kakianis um, Foundation's idea of spreading the relevance of ancient Greek culture and literature to contemporary audiences and also giving students and teachers an idea of how they might approach the material now. And of course that's been one of the wonderful challenges is how you turn epic like Homer into a play and also how you turn it into a, an ancient story into a play that speaks to a contemporary audience. One of the things that we focused on, unlike some efforts uh, at this, uh, this kind of material, is to not simply emphasize modern storytelling techniques, but to try to hold on to something of the language and, and, and poetic imagery of Homer, which of course is in some sense incomparable. So we offer a set of a production that is both uh, verbal and alert to Homeric language, but also filled with very interesting physicality and uh, actors' inventiveness. And this is part of what we're going to try to impart to the students who join us um, in our workshops because several of the actors are extremely well trained in physical theater, um, in circus, in acrobatics, in Suzuki technique, as well as in dramatic characterization and psychology and building characters. So all of this is part and parcel of what we will offer the students uh, in the workshops. Helping us bring this production to Greece is my collaborator, uh, Professor Katerina Zakaria from uh, Loyola Marymount University in Los Angeles. And I've worked with Katerina on several occasions in the past, particularly in a set of conferences that she helped organize called the Comparative Drama Conference. And we tried to liven that conference up by bringing in scenes from plays as well as simply talking heads, like you're seeing now. So to incorporate theatrical scene work and theatrical performance into a conference setting. So this is a, a, co a, a collaboration that's gone on for many, many years, but we're really, really thrilled to be able to bring this to uh, Athens. I'd also like to say that we're extremely appreciative of the Kakianis Foundation's sort of magnificent efforts to help bring this production and our company to Greece. And we've also been helped in that regard by Stanford University, which has put forth a fair bit of money to also help some of the students come along who assist in the production and to provide us with rehearsal space and all sorts of other um, uh, production assistance so that we can make this the, the, the fullest production we can offer. 
And also it's particularly moving to me to return to Greece now. I haven't been to Greece in probably now 10 years, I'm sad to say. But given all of the difficulties and troubles that, uh, that we know the Greek um, people and Greek societies face, it's particularly heartwarming for me to be able to come back at this time and to offer something of a gift back to the people of Greece who, as a classicist and a theater person, have given me so much. I mean, my career, insofar as I have one, has been built on working on Greek tragedy and many, many productions of Greek plays, absolutely timeless material, so relevant to us here in the United States, and of continuing, continuing relevance, I think, to many, many people. And I'd like to think that we're offering a little bit back to Greece that has given me and, and all of our company so much. So once again, we want to um, welcome, welcome you to our two weeks in Athens, encourage you to come and see our work, and uh, to thank you for your interest, and thank you so much for bringing Stanford Summer Theater and Wanderings of Odysseus to the Michael Kakianis Foundation.